Hi kids. I wondered if you've ever been on a long journey. Or maybe you've got a long journey planned over the summer holidays. In our family, the children have been counting how many sleeps are left until we go on holiday and they get to see their granny. I'll say hi granny because I know she's been watching our services. Well, the man we're going to learn about today, a man called John, wrote a book about a journey. But this was a different kind of journey. It wasn't a journey to visit his grandma or a journey to go on holiday. His book was about a really dangerous and difficult journey. A journey that would take him to be with Jesus in heaven. Now John's full name is John Bunyan. And the book is called A Pilgrim's Progress. I wonder if you've heard of it. It's one of the most famous books in the world and it's been translated into more than 200 languages. Now John lived a long time ago. He lived nearly 400 years ago because he was born in 1628. When John was alive, being a friend of Jesus could be difficult and it was quite often dangerous. John loved telling people about Jesus because he loved Jesus. But in those days, you weren't allowed to tell people about Jesus unless you had special permission from the king. That was King Charles II. Now John didn't have that permission from the king, but he told people about Jesus anyway because of how much he loved Jesus. And he was caught and he was put into prison for 12 years. Can you imagine that? Being put into prison just for talking about Jesus. I'm glad it's not like that now, aren't you? Well, John spent his time in prison writing books and it was whilst he was in prison that he wrote his famous book, A Pilgrim's Progress. The book is the story of a man called Christian who is travelling from his home to the celestial city. That's the name that John used for heaven. Christian's journey is really difficult and dangerous. But along the way, he meets people who help him, people who teach him about Jesus, people who encourage him along his way on the journey, and they walk with him on the way. And that kind of reminds me of other Christians, including all our friends at church. Now, even though Christian's journey in the book is difficult and dangerous, he keeps going. And he keeps going until he's safe and sound with his friend Jesus in heaven. John Bunyan, the writer, kept going following Jesus when things were dangerous and difficult for him, even when he was in prison, because he knew that Jesus would look after him and get him to heaven safe and sound. And I'm wondering this morning if you trust Jesus to look after you and to get you to heaven, however long or difficult the journey might be.